that the, in developing nations, one of the key questions is that in like, economic policies, uh, the creation of work in general, the, the decent work creation, growth that produces more jobs that are being produced now are essential. Because it's not that people don't work. People work everywhere, but they work at subsistence level, mm -hmm. they work in the informal economy, uh, they work in part-time, uh, in precarious work, etc. So the question is not whether people work or not. You know, you have to work to have livelihood and subsistence. The quality of work is simply not sufficient. Mainly in developing countries, but increasingly so in developed countries. And we see the way the crisis has hit Europe, has hit the United States, has hit Japan, in ways in which the, the notion that through growth, progress comes, you expand the middle classes and the future generation has a better life than the present has stopped. And this is a very major problem that we face today and that's an issue in which young people everywhere in developing and developed countries have to be fighting for policies that understand that creating a future for young people is the essence of uh, fairness and justice today. But the fundamental thing for policymakers, and this is the reason for this a meeting of the ILO in which we have made 46 consultations worldwide is that in taking decisions for what the ILO tripartite structure of employers, workers and governments thinks should be done on employment, we want the voice and the participation of young people with their experience, with their way they We, we very much adhere to the notion, no solution about us without us. And that's the sense of this forum.